Good morning guys, welcome back to another week's vlog. It is Monday morning, it's bright and early. I just filmed a video, I filmed the Sephora Favorites Glow For It Highlighting Kit Review and Swatches. That should be up, but if it isn't, it should be up very shortly. So I'll link it down below if it is up. But it's gonna be another crazy week. I'm actually not working as much this week because I'm going camping on Thursday. Me and Scott are driving up to New Hampshire. So that's gonna be interesting. I will be vlogging while I'm camping, but I like it that we're going up a day before everyone else. Um, and it's supposed to be sunny for Thursday and Friday. It looks like Saturday and Sunday is gonna rain because we are getting the after effects or we're, we're gonna get like a hurricane. So I'm not exactly sure what's going on with that, but I know, careful, I know rain is coming and wind. So what else, what else, what else? Um, I did order a, I didn't order it, I got it at my Sephora, the Too Faced Holiday Set. I, but I don't remember what it's called, but I'm gonna show you it right now because it is so pretty. And if you guys want a review on it, then let me know. Cause it's the holiday palette that comes with three. Hi, baby boy. You're always so loud. Hello. I'm also wearing my Victoria's Secret like Christmas pajamas as my bottom right now. Oh, my baby. It's my baby. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Such a good boy. Sometimes, right? Say, sometimes I'm good. Not all the time. But yeah, I'm gonna show you that palette because it is so pretty and I'm really excited about it. I'm also getting my roots done tomorrow because for some reason, like look at my hair, it is so dark on top and it drives me absolutely nuts. Like I feel like as soon as I get my hair done, it already needs to be get done. It already needs to be done again. Hi. Thank you. Oh, that's so sweet of you. Thank you. <laughs> okay, I will show you that palette and yeah, I'll show you that now. Okay, so this is the palette. It's called the Too Faced Grand Hotel Cafe. So when you open it up, you can open these little, actually you can take that off. You can open these little sleeves. And it's so beautiful. So it is for Christmas. It has a mini Too Faced um, mascara right there, Better Than Sex. And then it comes with three palettes. So it comes with the Too Faced Eggnog Latte. And these are all scented as well. It comes with the Too Faced Gingerbread Cookie. And then it comes with the Peppermint Mocha. So adorable. And then, as you can see, the inside packaging how adorable it's like set up like a little cafe and then in the menu it has the three palettes that's adorable i'm keeping this forever so i will show you quickly these palettes so this one is the peppermint one how beautiful are those shades i'm obsessed with this one because i love that middle one the sprinkles i think that's really pretty mm, and it has like a very light scent to it very light peppermint mocha scent. So that's the first one. This next one is called Gingerbread Cookie. Look at those shimmery shades. I love that ginger snap in the right hand corner. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, and the winter dream is like a lavender gray. So pretty. And then this last one, I haven't even swatched these or anything. This last one is Eggnog Latte. And look at that middle shade, Cold Brew. Looks so pretty. So yeah, if you guys want a review on these or like a swatch video, let me know because I haven't even swatched them, but they're adorable and you can separate these and um, give them away for Christmas because it has the to and from. But you know me, I'm probably gonna keep these for myself. I don't have like a lot of friends that enjoy makeup. I'm like the only one. So yeah, that's what I wanted to show you guys and I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Hi, hi baby, hi. So I just came home and I got my Urban Remedy package. And this is all of my juices. This is pretty nice how it comes like packaged with ice packs. That's pretty cool. So let's see what I have in here. I'm so excited for this. So looks like we have PB&J. Mm-hmm. I have to put all this in the refrigerator. Ooh, vanilla cashew nut milk. That sounds delicious. Why are you a thirsty puppy? And then, what do we have here? Ooh, chai. 
Yes! I have like little lights that I got from Target. I think those are pretty. Um, I have cold brew. This is just a coffee. A lot of like brown drinks. Slender greens. Mmm. I don't know if that one's going to be that tasty. What do I have here? Chocolate banana. How exciting is this? How many more do I have? Oh. I have warrior. This is raspberry, strawberries, chai seeds, and stevia. I have happy belly. Supports digestive health. Mm-hmm. And then I think I just have this little turbo shot. Holy shit. This is a big turbo shot. Hot shot, beet, apple, and ginger. That's very cool. Hi guys, welcome back. I got my hair done. I don't know if I showed you, but it is a lot blonder and I really like it. I think it came out really nice this time. Um, but me and Scott are going to New Hampshire today. It is the afternoon and it's actually two o'clock. I haven't had anything to eat or drink today. So I'm going to drink this on the way. This is the Urban Remedy Cold Brew Light. I'm hoping it tastes really good. I tried the chai one and I, I did not like it. It literally tastes like um, Indian food. Like the aftertaste was Indian food. And I love Indian food, but I don't want it in a drink with chai. So to me, I did not like that one. But hopefully I will like this one because it's just a coffee. But yeah, we're going to New Hampshire. I hope it's a nice, like relaxing, fun weekend. There's been something that's been bothering me and I'm not going to get into it, but it has been weighing heavy on me. So I hope that this weekend is good and I just like forget about things and it is hopefully resolved at one point. I know that's not saying much, but I just don't want to mention anything about it yet until I know what exactly is going on. But yeah, we're going to New Hampshire and I will talk to you guys once I am on the way with Scott. We're on our way to New Hampshire. Scott's in the best mood of his life. <laughs> I love traffic. <laughs> we're in a little bit of traffic, but we're listening to Drake, so it's all good. But this is ridiculous. Hopefully we get there before sundown. Hi guys, so we're at a restaurant called the Black Mountain Burger. We just, Black, yeah, company. We decided to eat out tonight because it was like really late when we got here. We were in traffic for what? Four hours it took us to get here. <laughs> so we just got burgers and I got the triple, triple decker. So it's like grilled cheese and a burger some fries and I got this really good drink it's called pumpkin spice and it has um, vodka Bailey's and something else that I can't remember but it's really good what'd you get Thai chili burger mm. and an IPA and then we're gonna go back into the darkness after I will show you guys the setup tomorrow we're at the river it's super low It's really pretty. Scott's dunking his head. And we're gonna try and take a nice fall picture. We'll see how it comes out. What's up? Hi guys. We are driving around, just got coffee so we don't get headaches. Well, I got ice apple cider. I already have a headache. <laughs> but Scott needs his coffee. We also got some more wood and ice and food to eat. Mm -hmm. What else? We got a better campsite because oh, yeah. we had a smaller one and then the people next to us, we saw them packing up and leaving and we kind of just like stalked their campsite until they we saw that they were going in their car and then we moved our things really quickly and we actually picked up the whole tent with the air mattress and everything in it and just carried it over. Because we got more people coming, so we, it's a better site, secluded, bigger. There's a path that leads right to the river. Posted an Instagram picture at the river, which is really low tide, but still posted it, but yeah. I'll Setting up for the festival for tomorrow. All oh, those are some cool hats. There's yeah. a whole big thing, Columbus Day weekend in this town. It's mm -hmm. Harvest Festival or something. Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. 
Yeah. Is it Monday too? I think so, yeah. I really would like to go to the festival because I think this is like the third or fourth year that I've seen the festival but not gone to the festival. Festival? Yeah. <laughs> festival. All right, my arm's tired. Yeah, it's hot here. So this is our new campsite and I think it's pretty huge. I think it's a good size. And we just got a ton of stuff. We got Duncan and we're probably gonna go by the river and take a walk in a little while and make food. It is Saturday morning and I feel like I was the first one awake. I got all ready. A lot of people are still sleeping. Scott is the only one that's awake now. But he ran to the bathroom. Of course, I had to do full glam. Not full glam, but I definitely did the lashes. And I did a CC cream, lip gloss, and eyebrows. So that's what we're working with today. And my voice is super deep because I'm tired. But today I think we're going to the festival. I think they have like mousse chocolate and crafts and little trinkets that you can buy. So I think that's what we're doing today. We were going to go on a hike, but it is supposed to rain later on. So we don't want to risk it. I personally feel like it's not good to go on a hike when it's like wet because I feel like it'll be really slippery. So we're going to go to the festival and we're having going to have a relaxing day. I drank a lot last night, so I'm gonna try not to drink that much today. I just don't even want alcohol. You know when you drink a lot of alcohol one night and then the next day you're just like, I'm never drinking again? That's how I feel right now. I just don't like feeling like this. But yeah, I guess I will talk to you guys maybe once everyone is up and we are doing something else. We're definitely gonna cook breakfast. I think we're having bacon and eggs and me and Scott are gonna run out to get coffee, but we're kind of blocked in right now. So that's what we're doing, and I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. So we just came back from the festival. Thank you. Ow. And we got some chocolate. I got. That really scared me that they left. I thought I was gonna get left behind. <laughs> My cell phone's dead. Oh no. And it's in their car too. Say hi, Sean. Sean? Oh, hi. <laughs> Okay, I got chocolate covered gummies. And then I got a chocolate peanut butter cup. Baby, you left my door open. I don't think they can get in. Chocolate um, peanut butter fudge. <laughs> chocolate pretzels. Oh, I got a lot. Lots of chocolate. What's this? Fudge? Fudge, yeah. What's this? Uh, chocolate covered gummy bears, which I've never heard of. I don't think I'm gonna like that. What's that? Uh, this is a um, Oreo. <laughs> and then I got this salsa, the chocolate mousse. Black bean and sweet corn salsa. What? Oh. So that's what I got at the festival. <laughs> Thanks, babe. <laughs> it's an obstacle. Ah, uh, I don't know. Whoa. Be careful. <laughs> we can make it further. Good afternoon, guys. It is Monday afternoon. I actually have to have this vlog up in a few hours, but I am going out right now. I made it back yesterday. We came back from camping yesterday, which was Sunday. It started raining all day, so it was a good thing that we came back. Um, and right now I'm going to go to Marshall's because I want to get a toy for Teddy. And I also want to look at the decorations that they have there. And then I also want to go to Bath and Body Works because the candles right now are buy one get one free. And then I also need to get underwear because it's funny, I was just watching Michelle's uh, vlog from Vlogtober and she just said that she like ran out of underwear, she can't find any. I am the exact same way, like I don't know what happened to all my underwear but I need new underwear. So that is what I'm doing and also I wanted to share with you that I got the Lorac Mega Pro Palette number three in the mail. 
and I am so excited about it. I haven't swatched anything. I haven't swatched anything, but this is the palette, so it was $59. I got it from Ulta, but I'm gonna open it up and share it with you guys. Let's see what it looks like. So the only downside, I think, is this white packaging because although it is beautiful and white and rose gold, this is gonna get dirty so fast. But, well, let's see if we can do this. Come on. But those are all of the colors. That looks so pretty. I can't wait for this palette. I'm gonna use so many of these shades. I love the mauves and the bronzes and oh, I just love them. I think the only ones that I'm a little skeptical about are this one, that one, and that one. Other than that, I will use every single one of these. So I think that is so beautiful. I just wanted to share that with you guys. And I think I'm gonna end this vlog now. <sighs> Tomorrow's gonna be a really scary day for me and I haven't mentioned, I should probably drive a little. Um, I haven't mentioned what has been going on with me and I'm still not going to. But thank you for keeping me in your prayers. I know I mentioned something on Twitter and something is going on with me and I can, I'm not gonna say anything else other than that but I really appreciate all of your well wishes because tomorrow I'm just like, tomorrow's Tuesday and I'm super scared. I'm going to the doctor tomorrow and I don't know, I feel like my heart rate has been up this entire weekend and I'm just like on the verge of tears at any second and I've just been like really scared. So that's what's happening. Um, but I'm trying to get out of the house and like get some fresh air and do a little shopping to make me feel a little bit better. So that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna go home and edit this vlog in a few hours and I will see you guys in my next week's vlog.